Hey, it's Brian G. Johnson. I'd like to welcome you to MarketingEasyStreet.com. And today I've got a fantastic, very powerful link building strategy, a method, a tactic that you can use to absolutely catapult your sites to the top of Google. And I know, I know that sounds like a lot of hype, but what's interesting is that this strategy is so far removed from what people are teaching, the kind of uh, stuff you see available when it comes to uh, link building. This method relies on a little bit of effort and delivers uh, on that effort and gives you those rankings that, that you're looking for. Now, I first started sharing this strategy with uh, customers of mine in the SEO Press Formula course that I launched back in 2008. And recently, in 2011, I shared uh, this strategy with my coaching students, and a lot, so many of them have used this to get extremely powerful links. So, I want to go through with uh, you how the system works, why it's so incredibly powerful, and how you can duplicate uh, my success. Now, I want to let you know I've used this myself personally on probably about six to eight sites, and every single time I've been able to achieve success in, in the, the way of getting really these high caliber links with PageRank on domains that have been around forever. And uh, I've I simply followed this strategy, followed the tactic, and I've, I've had the success I've been after that I've been looking for. And it's resulted in those great rankings. So you can do this. It's worth your time. Let's go through it. So first off, I gave you a little uh, background. I've shared this a little bit. I want to talk to you about why this method works so incredibly uh, good in 2011, 2012, and beyond. When we're talking about Google, the Google algorithm, the primary factor is quality. I'm going to say that again. Quality trumps everything when it comes to Google. And that goes for the quality of the content on your website. It goes for your link building efforts. If you're getting thousands and thousands of links from social bookmarking sites, that's not really a quality link. You can get those kind of links easily. Anybody can go to Dig or Facebook. Anyone can uh, socially bookmark their own site. But when Google sees links coming in from sites it trusts, from sites that it deems uh, relevant and worthy of high rankings, those are the kind of sites uh, that can deliver these very powerful links. And that's exactly what we do. We're targeting sites within our own niche. Um, and again, it's really a, a factor of trust and quality today with Google. And this method delivers because we're not trying to get thousands and thousands of links. Rather, we're really targeting the sites we want to get links from. Usually these sites have been around for five, ten years, three years, a long time, and they have page rank. And like I said, more important is that they have trust with Google. And when they link to you, that trust is passed on to your site. And as those links uh, age with Google, uh, you, you ultimately get more trust, more page rank, and it really begins to impact your rankings in a powerful way. So the end result is ultimately you're going to be able to get uh, what's called blog rolled by other blogs or other sites that are run by WordPress, which so many sites today online are, are run by WordPress. It can also be a blogger site. Really, any site that's run on a blogging platform, you're going to be able to get people to link to your site um, on their link section. And what's really powerful is oftentimes every single page of their site has the link section. So ultimately, it's not like you're getting one link, but you're getting a site-wide link uh, across uh, several different um, sites, and it can really have this profound effect on you. So the first thing to do when you want to get started with this uh, system, the Let's Get Blog World system, is that you really want to make sure that your site fits uh, certain criteria. Number one, uh, make sure you have something worthy of sharing with visitors and ultimately webmasters. So visitors are pretty particular. They're looking for high quality content that can help them with whatever they're looking for. And webmasters even more so. They're going to be incredibly um, uh, strict with what types of sites they link to. So this method does not really work for crappy, low quality, gray hat, spun uh, websites. And if you have that, this probably isn't for you. But if you're building quality sites that are going to be here today and be here tomorrow, then this site can really uh, do wonders for your site. So when you have a site with great content 
and you're ready to share it with visitors and other webmasters that potentially can link to you, then you move forward. The first thing you're going to want to do once you're to that point is you're going to want to establish some target sites. And these are ultimately sites that you're going to request a link from when the time is right. And I usually like to start off with between 10 and 15 target sites. And the reason why is yeah, when the time is right, like I mentioned, you're going to ask these webmasters, these site owners, uh, to link to your site. And you're going to do that uh, in a very specific way after you've performed some tasks. And not everybody that you link to, that you ask for the link, is going to link to you. So if you start off with 10 or 15, usually I uh, probably the worst I've ever done is about 25 to 30 percent success. So if I've got uh, 10 sites that I'm targeting, I'll probably get three or four site-wide links. And the best I've done is probably about 70 percent, which is pretty uh, amazing. So what you're going to want to do is find these target sites and you're going to link to those sites in your links section and you're going to make sure the link section is visible on your WordPress site. Now, you're not just going to link to any site that you think is a good site. Um, you have to make sure that there's certain criteria that is met that will increase your chances of getting the link from the webmaster. So first thing is... Uh, da -da 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 -da. Uh, the site should be based on your niche. So if you've got a site on cooking, find some really great cooking sites. Second thing is you want to make sure that the site you're going to target is already linking out to other websites. If they are, the chance of you getting a link is pretty darn good. However, if they're not linking to anybody, obviously the chance of you getting a link is going to diminish and decrease. And thirdly, you want to make sure the site in question has been recently updated. Because as I mentioned, you're going to go ahead and you're going to request the webmaster, uh, the site owner, link to your site. And if they're not paying attention, if they're no longer actively building their website, obviously the chance of them doing that has diminished greatly. So again, it should be a site based on or very uh, similar to your niche. Uh, it should be linking to other websites similar to yours. And it should be uh, have been recently updated. And once you find those things, once you find 10 to 15 sites like that, you're going to list all of those sites in, you, in your link section. And then what you're going to do is every three or four days, you're going to visit uh, the sites from your own site. And the reason you do that is these webmasters, many of them will start to see traffic flowing from your site to theirs. And they're probably going to check out your site and go, oh, here's a site based on my same niche. And from right there, uh, you'll be amazed. Sometimes you'll get a link um, from that point uh, right there. Um, and you visit the site from your link section so the webmaster can see the referral. And you're going to leave a relevant, well-thought-out comment in the uh, comment section. And I like to do this with recent posts. So I go to the site that I'm trying to obtain a link from, and I leave a well-thought-out comment on a recent post that the webmaster has made. Now, anytime I make a post, I'm sure hoping someone will comment. It's nice to see comments. And when you come in and you leave a relevant, well-thought-out comment, it can really help you. Now, there are a lot of software apps that can do this for you, but they can't leave the well-thought-out comment. And again, you don't need 100,000 links. What you need is four or five site-wide links from some sites that are trusted in Google, and that can have a profound effect on your ability to drive traffic and to rank in the search engines. So that's how the process begins. You simply begin every three or four days, you visit the sites from your link section. If there's new content posted, you leave a well thought out con comment and make sure you add value. Um, don't say this is a great post. If it's about vintage artwork, share your thoughts on this subject. Add in some information. Um, maybe share some, some formulas. Share something that, again, really matters and make sure you spend time doing this. It doesn't take a lot of time. Literally, you can have this done uh, in 30 minutes uh, twice a week and after a period of 46 weeks, it can have an, a very, very powerful effect on your ranking. So this is the kind of stuff that makes sense uh, to do. You know, it's not a ton of work, but just a little bit of work can have so much effect on your ability to, to rank.
And that's literally all you do. You find the target sites, you add them to your link section, and then over time, you add comments to new posts. And the idea is you get to uh, bond with the webmaster. If you know their name, use their name. Start uh, becoming a regular on their site. And after a period of four to six weeks or so, then you, you're going to ask uh, the, the webmaster for a link to your website. And the way I usually do this is I do it in a comment. I go to the site again, and after I've left no less than about five comments over uh, at least a month period or so, I'll come in and I'll basically say, you know, uh, I'll comment on the, the article again, as I've mentioned. And then I'll say, Jim, Susie Q, whatever your name, I want to let you know I've been linking to your site uh, from my site that's also on the same subject. And if you... Uh, wouldn't mind, I'd sure appreciate if you would be willing to link to me. Now, uh, you, you'll get a lot of yeses. You'll be surprised that you get a lot of yeses. You'll get some no's, and that's okay. It's a numbers game. Uh, you might get some people that say, you should pay me. Uh, we've got that before, and we just say, no, thank you, because we know we'll get lots of them uh, free, uh, no payment, and it can have, again, this profound effect. So this is the Let's Get Blog Road method. Uh, if you've used this method before, uh, share your comments below this post. And again, thanks for stopping by. Really great, powerful tactic. Go ahead, use this yourself. I think you're going to see how powerful it is. And do me a favor, if you've liked this, uh, this uh, video, this article, uh, share, this, share the content. You know, click the like button and, uh, and pass it on. So Brian Johnson from Marketing Easy Street, thanks for watching this video, and we'll see you soon. Take care.